Hey guys. Hey, don't forget to uh, order these uh, Get Bent shirts, man. Uh, you guys buy these shirts. Uh, I promise with my addiction to molds that uh, any money I make will go straight to uh, jig molds. <laughs> so get you some. Be the coolest guy in the parking lot. Uh, I'll add the link below so you can just go to the link and order the you'll get you'll get bent shirt. Yeah. For sure. Cowdy fishing, get bent. Don't forget to get you one. Hey guys, on this trip out on the water, uh, let's look at the mold that I used to make the, the jigs that well that frog jig that I was using. Let's take a look at this thing because um, you know, a lot of times you, you have to downsize on your bait. So this is a good downsize bait, this little frog right here. And we'll shoot, uh, we'll shoot some uh, plastic in here and you can, you can take a look at what it looks like, but it'll, it'll catch fish. Now, granted, uh, this trip, I didn't catch any keepers with this little frog, uh, but they, I did catch a lot of, a lot of eight inch, nine inch crappie with the, the frog. I just gave up on it because it just couldn't uh, uh, hit, uh, couldn't hit on big fish with it. So, but we'll make, we'll make some jigs with it. All right, let's shoot this in that frog. It's a real small mold, so it don't take a lot of plastic. That's it. Let's open this up and see what this frog looks like. If you're making colors, this frog is great. If you're creating a color and you want to look at what it looks like after you shoot it, this, this frog seems like it's the perfect size for that. But here we go. Let's get them out of there. You know, that's the mold up close. Hope there's the light is good on that. Here's the frog. And those those little legs get busy when you're pulling it through the water. They really have a lot of action in them. And I, I like I said, I caught a lot of little fish with him with this frog, but I don't remember catching a keeper with it. I imagine brown fishing this frog would do pretty good too. Okay, let's let's look at this bait I call crazy legs. So basically this it's a, a grub with with some uh, with you know some little wiggly legs on it. And you can see it there. But if you really if you're interested in buying this mold, just hit me in the comment and I'll tell you where I got it from, but I tell you what, there's a lot of baits out there that look really similar to this, and it's you probably get the same results. But uh, man, I can't. Anytime the the, the fish are, fishing get hard, I'll I'll pull this this uh, bait out and use it since I've been making it. And I tell you what, it's it the fish. If there's a group of them, one of them's gonna hit this thing. You know, I'm not gonna say you're gonna catch a bunch of fish with it, but I mean, it, it seems like every time I use it, that the, one fish always seems to wanna hit it. So crazy legs. We're gonna shoot this. Let me show you how I, I, I do this one. Okay, we're gonna shoot some crazy legs. So we're gonna go with the short truce first.
Yeah, let's open this crazy leg mode and see what we got. Okay. So basically what I'm gonna do is just trim off these legs like so. So I got them all trimmed off. I'll reuse that. To make it easier to get them in the, get them in that mold, I uh, just add a little oil to them. Uh, it'll make them a little more pliable. Look like everyone's in position, ready for that head shot. So uh, we're gonna go with some brown. Shoot it on top of there. Okay, I'm gonna shoot the heads of Mr. Crazy Legs. All right, let's take this out and see what it looks like. There you have it. Crazy legs, some brown and short truths. Tell you what, this is a fish catching bait. I imagine any bait with, you know, a bunch of little wiggly legs on it would work really good, but I found that it's like, it's like my second favorite bait. So if you want to know uh, any information on this mold, just hit me up in the comments and I'll, I'll give you the info on it. A little tiny frog will catch crappie. This is about the fourth or fifth small fish I have caught with that little tiny frog. So I switched in this spot, I switched to a larger bait to see if it was just a frog. Just a little fish here. One of my homemade baits, uh, orange and chartreuse. 
I call this thing the shrimp because it looks like a shrimp to me. Get it on the on the drop. Fish. Just realized I didn't have my gloves on. Yeah, that's a good fish. Yeah,
That is a nice fish and I just barely caught him. Two more seconds in the water, he would have been gone. That's that crazy leg jig I was telling you about. Hey guys, thanks for watching. Thanks for subscribing. If you haven't subscribed, please subscribe. I really appreciate that. Uh, that Wind Riders, uh, uh, you go to their website. I can get you 10% discount on everything in their website. So check out Wind Riders. Until the next time, you know what I'm going to say. Get out there and get bent, son. You could do it.